Hey guys, welcome to Cute Tea Drawings. Today I'll be drawing Finn from Mashal. I'll be drawing on my tablet, but you can also follow along on paper, and please remember to like and subscribe. Okay, now let's get started. Okay, let's first start off by drawing the eyes. Let's draw two lines across for the tops. Then underneath, let's draw a diagonal line down on both sides. Now for the bottom of the eyes, let's draw a line across and then bring it up at the end. And then one more smaller angle next to it on the outside. Next, let's move inside and let's draw a circle, but we're gonna leave it open slightly on the left side. Next, on top of the eye, let's draw another curve across. And then lastly, let's thicken up the top lines of the eyes. Now let's add a curve on top of each eye for the eyebrows. and then thicken each of these up slightly towards the center. And that's it for the eyes. Now let's move in between and draw the nose. Let's draw two small lines down. Now next to the nose, let's draw three circles on both sides. Next, before we continue drawing the face, let's move up and let's start drawing the hair. Let's start on top in the center and let's draw a small V. And then let's work our way out with a zigzag line on both sides. Now on top, let's draw two curves up and out from the center. and then a long curve down on both sides. Now inside the two triangle sections at the top, let's draw some curved lines. Now before we finish drawing the hair, let's move inside and let's draw the chin. At the bottom, let's draw two angled lines coming down to a point. And then let's move inside and let's draw two curves with a gap in the center for the mouth. Next, let's add the magic mark underneath the left eye. Let's draw a line down. And then let's thicken this line up. And that's it for the face. Now let's move back up and finish drawing the hair. On top in the center, let's draw another set of curved lines up and out. And then let's curve it down on both sides like this. Now underneath on the left side, let's bring it up. And then one more curve down to close it off. Now for the right side, let's draw a smaller curve up. Another pointed V. And then a curve out to finish it off. Next, let's hop back up to the top and let's draw another small set of curves up and out. And then curve it down and out on both sides. Then 
Then at the bottom, let's angle it back in. And that's it for the head. Now let's move down and let's draw the neck. We'll start with two curves down underneath the head. And then two angled curves underneath, meeting at a point. Now inside the neck, let's draw a V-shape shadow at the top. And color this in black. And then on the bottom left, let's draw an angled line up. Now underneath, let's draw the collar of the shirt. Start on the sides of the neck and let's draw a small line out on both sides. Then let's angle it down and out. Now from the bottom, let's bring it back inwards. And then bring it back up. Now in between the collar here, let's draw the tie. Let's start with a line across, and then two angles underneath. And connect them at the bottom. Now for the rest of the tie, let's draw another set of angles down underneath. Next, let's hop to the sides and let's draw a curve down on the left and on the right. And then another curve inside on both sides. Now to finish drawing the robe, let's start back up next to the neck and let's draw a line out on both sides. Then let's angle it down. And then a set of curves down underneath. Now for the shoulders, let's draw another line out. Angle it down. And then bring it down on both sides. And that's it for Finn. Now let's quickly color it in. And done. Hope you enjoyed drawing along with me and please remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching!